Feeling low on energy, not sleeping well, want to lose a little weight? Today we'll meet Matthew who answered yes to all of those questions. Let me show you how to go about a 21 day whole food cleanse that will make not only Matthew, but you feel like a younger you. I'm on top of the world and now I'm living And the good just gets better, keeps a giving Not even close to the end, it's just beginning Life is getting lighter while the days are getting brighter, yeah And if the good, I won't even worry anymore To call my care, still can kick them all out the door Go on a try, come and tell me what you're waiting for Move and keep them going till your life is overflowing, yeah Welcome to the show. Today on The Younger You, we're talking about food cleansers and colon hydrotherapy. Many problems can arise from eating processed foods and using products filled with chemicals. Some of those problems are congestion, joint pain, poor digestion, weight gain, and of course, fatigue. Dr. Gordon thought he could help a friend of mine, Matthew, rid the toxins from his life and feel more energized. Let's find out how. I don't think people look at me and think he's so fat, but when I talk about being fat, people don't deny it anymore. You know, they get kind of quiet. And I see pictures of myself and I don't like it. I'm embarrassed being overweight. All right, Matthew, uh, we got your results that we had you fill out before you came into our office. Mm -hmm. um, and then it was a little disturbing. <laughs> so we've got some things we need to work on. Okay. Um, the first thing that we looked at that showed up was uh, sugar handling. So I don't right. know if you eat a lot of sugar or... Probably, yeah. With your diet, yeah. Right yeah. now your body's just not processing sugar the okay. way it's supposed to. I got to the stage over time, eating poorly and, and making poor decisions in my diet. Do you do a lot of sodas or juices or anything? Diet soda, lots of diet soda, yep. Okay. That's part of the sugar there. Yeah. And then if you're not getting, do you get a lot of vegetables? No. You've heard of vegetables, right? I've heard of vegetables. Okay. <laughs> it's not just the way that I look, but it's the way that I feel. I feel tired, I feel sluggish, I feel crappy. And I want to feel more energy and more alive and uh, I just want to feel better. Second thing was um, kind of your liver. Liver's not functioning the way that it should be. A lot of times when we're, our bodies are burdened with a lot of toxins and stress, then that just really builds up in the liver. You're never not being judged by somebody. So weight is part of that. Although I do think that we, as Americans, have gotten fatter, it, the conversation is getting louder and louder and louder. But I don't want people having that conversation about me. The third thing that, that showed up was digestion, right. which obviously if you're eating, drinking a lot of soda, eating barbecue and candies and sweets and stuff like that, mm -hmm. you're, you're not going to have good digestion. One of the reasons I want to do this is so my clothes fit. I don't like going to the store and buying bigger sizes. I feel ashamed and embarrassed and I feel unattractive. I think the thing, one of the things that can concerns me, I guess, is there's so many crutches that I uh, use throughout the day to get me to the next, the next level, I guess, caffeine or sugar and so. So the nice thing about this is um, usually after about day four or five-ish, a lot of those cravings and things that you're going to have are going to start to go away. By the if you stick to the cleanse, by the time you get done with this, you'll have no sugar cravings. Wow. I think the 21 day cleanse is sounds great to me because it's a short term with a, a deadline. Like I can see the end goal. It's actually pretty simple. So um, you're going to be on a, on a shake and supplements for the full 21 days. Um, the first 10 days you're going to be basically sticking with fruits and vegetables. Twice as many veggies as fruit. Uh, and then the next 10 days then we're going to add in uh, lean meats, chicken and fish, just small portions. I like that they're, that it's short term, I like that there are rules to follow, I like being accountable uh, for my choices, I like having that, that sort of set of instructions to follow, I need that. The other okay. thing that we're going to add to it as well, it, that's really going to help a lot with your digestion and, in, and aid in this detoxification that we're going to be doing with you, is colon hydrotherapy, okay? So we're basically going to go through and help to flush out uh, a lot of the buildup and waste that's basically stuck to the colon 
and get your colon clean, healthy, get the, the good flora, the good bacteria rebuilt back up in there so that that'll help aid with your digestion so we're not having some of the digestive issues. I'm doing this because I'm at a stage where I want to be healthier and I want to have more energy and I can feel the effects of, of my diet. Believe it or not, it's, it's fairly relaxing. Um, so basically we're just going to gently fill your colon full of water. It'll get to a point where you feel that urge to eliminate, you'll eliminate. We're going to fill it again, eliminate, and you're going to keep doing that for about 35, 40 minutes each, each time you come. And there are people like, are you in there by yourself, are you in there with... You're going to be, you'll be in there by yourself. I, I, I usually okay. will come in, or sometimes my assistant will come in, uh, in the very beginning and at the very end. You know, unless you have a problem, then we can come in as well. But typically, yeah, you're, you're able to do everything on your own. It's, it's, it's pretty simple. Okay. Um, the nice thing too about the, the way that our system works is uh, afterwards, everything, everything that you eliminate is going to go into a tank. And so we can actually take a look at, at everything that's in there. Wow. So they can, you can see from the inside out. Exactly. I think what's most attractive to me about this cleanse is having the guidance of Dr. Gordon to tell me how to eat, not just during the cleanse, but after the cleanse. And I don't feel like I've ever gotten that from trainers or from reading books. I mean, it's, I think having a coach to help me through this is what is most appealing to me about it. Like I said, to really get the maximum benefits of, of doing this and basically starting this new lifestyle, we want to get you in the habit of, of exercising. So you'll be doing some light cardio. Uh, usually it's about 20 minutes a day. Um, it is a little intense when we have you do it, but usually only have to do it for 20 minutes. And then if you'd like to do any weight training, you can, it's up to you. But cardio okay. is going to be a, a, a big part of it. I, I want to show people that they can do it and that 21 days is, is such a short amount of time for hopefully something that will be a huge lifestyle change for me. And something that they that anybody can do. Okay, so since you're here today and you're ready to get started, we're gonna start you out with your first session with colon hydrotherapy today. You ready? I I guess. Yeah, yeah sure. Let's go. <laughs> Okay, Matthew, we're here. You ready? As ready as I'll ever be. Okay. So, like I said, it's it's not too bad. It's fairly relaxing. Okay. So what you're gonna do is you're basically gonna undress from the waist down. Okay. Okay. We have a small speculum here. This is what you're gonna basically insert up your rectum. Okay. okay. I know it looks pretty scary, but it only goes in about an inch and a half or so. Okay. So okay. it's not, not too too bad. Okay. okay. You're gonna use this lubrication packet here. Just rip off the edge. Shove the tube in there so the tube gets nice and lubricated. That way things slide in nice and easy. Okay. okay. Um, basically, you're going to be on your back here. Your legs will go over those bolsters, and then you'll use that towel over there to basically cover the lower half of your body. Okay. Okay. So once you're in position and you're all covered up, just press the white doorbell on the wall here, and then I'll come in and we'll, we'll walk you through what you're going to be doing. Okay. Okay. Coming up after the break, I'll be checking in with Matthew to see how he's doing with his cleanse and Dr. Gordon will be explaining the steps Matthew needs to take next. Be sure to check out the Younger You website to watch full episodes of the show. Stay up to date on the Younger You Challenge and get useful tips and tricks to help you achieve the Younger You. Welcome back. Let's see how Matthew is doing with his 21 day cleanse. So we're at day 11. Right. Okay. You're looking amazing. <laughs> I've seen you. a big difference in your body yeah. shape as well. Yeah. You've been going to the gym. Yep. Okay. Day 11, you were allowed to introduce some meat. Yes, exactly. I wasn't allowed to have any meat for the first 10 days. So I'm excited to eat this chicken uh -huh. breast. Okay. Uh, see what that's like. This is the right amount of chicken that you're allowed to start eating tonight? This is actually twice. So I'm, I'm going to bake this for mm. about 15 minutes and I have a meat thermometer which has also been one of the greatest things for me because cooking chicken, people always cook it too dry. Uh, 
But if you if you put the meat thermometer until it gets to about 165, it's perfect. Okay. So what I'll do is cook this chicken breast and then cut it in half. This is twice as much as you should have in one right. okay. sitting. Right, okay. Okay. Yeah. So I love these bell peppers. You've got the avocados, you've got great carrots. Yep. Okay, sweet potatoes, or as you call it here, yams. Yams, okay. yep. Okay, um, do you bake that with the skin on, or are you peeling it well, off? Well, I also do a lot of sweet potato fries, so oh. I, and everybody loves those. So I love them. Yeah. No, but you know, one of the great things is I fill up so much on vegetables, and that's the thing I think people don't realize. If you eat vegetables and fruit, it fills your stomach up. Mm. And then with the supplements that, I was take, that I've been taking, um, I just didn't crave that stuff. I would see it mm. and I would be like, wow, that looks good, but I don't want it. There's one thing I always find when you do these type of cleanses and get your nutrition back on track is that the minute you have processed food, it just doesn't taste that great. Mm -hmm. You crave this sort of healthy food again. Yeah. And financially, how hard has it been to only buy healthy, fresh food? I think it's actually saved me money. Okay. Uh, being prepared, buying everything at once, um, veggies fill you, I mean it fills you up so you just not, you don't want more food. Um, so financially I think it's, it's a wash. You've been having your, your colon therapy. Yeah. Hydro colon therapy <laughs> I should yes. say. Um, how's that been? It's actually great. It's, I, yeah, I mean I don't know how to describe it. Well, I'm going to tell you because you, I phoned you a few days in. And I said, Matthew, how are you feeling? And you said to me, Troy, I feel lighter. I feel yeah. cleaner. Well, the first um, couple days were rough. Mm. Uh, coming off caffeine was rough. I had a headache yeah. for about two days. But after, by the third day, I felt great. Mm. And I've just kept getting better and better ever since. And I do feel lighter. And the exercise has gotten easier. Because what I've discovered is that oh. when you weigh less, it's easier it's to It's easier on the joints. It's easier to do, <laughs> yes, yes. Um, the support network from Dr. Gordon. How's oh, it been? fantastic, really? fantastic. And I've really gotten to know uh, the people that work there, including his family. And Wow. Yeah. It's a yeah. family affair. Yeah, his wife and his kids are there sometimes, and they're super sweet, and yeah. I've just felt fabulous. What week. do you think you're going to do when you finish all of this? Do you think you're going to go back into everyday eating? The funny thing is I always hated salads. Mm -hmm. And now I really love really? salads. I love having a salad okay. for lunch. And I can get through the afternoon so much easier with so much more energy, having really healthy, good ingredients to get me through the day. You've broken your habit, haven't you? Yes, I can tell I have. you have. Yeah. yeah, you look amazing. Thank you. So I wish you all the best Thank you, Troy. for the rest of your cleanse. And I look forward to seeing the results. Thanks. Alright Matthew, so we just finished a 21 day cleanse, how do you feel? I feel great, really great. What are some of the changes that you noticed from the cleanse? I have more energy, I sleep better. Um, I think one of the biggest things that I noticed right away was that I um, had better dreams. Because I don't ever think about the dreams that I have really having anything to do with my diet. So how has your lifestyle changed compared to where you were eating you know, fast foods and whatever you got at the candy machine all the time. <laughs> you know, how has that changed now with your, with your lifestyle? Well, the key for me is being prepared. So making sure that there's plenty of, of uh, fresh fruits and vegetables uh, and making sure that my supplements were where they needed to be. And um, because of my job, like I just had to make sure that wherever I was, that there were things to sort of grab onto when I needed them. How hard was it for you to prepare those meals and, and, eat, and eat that way? The shakes were such a big part of it that the meals were sort of simple and easy to prepare. So no, I didn't think it was hard. Yeah, good. 
Well, here's the thing. So we did the 21 day cleanse. We went through the program. Right. We've retrained you on, on, on how to eat, mm -hmm. what to eat, and we've gotten a lot of that stuff out of your system. Yep. There's kind of one thing that we're going to do to take it just a step further in making sure we just we have you working at optimal health. Okay. And that's, we're going to do a, a parasite cleanse with you. Okay. So no. again, it, you know, I, I don't want you being scared with the, the term cleanse. This one right. really isn't too, too bad. I'm more scared of the term parasite than I am cleanse. Well, that's the thing. I and mean, we want to get those parasites yeah. out of your system. Yeah. We don't want them being in there. So with this cleanse, we're just going to put, put you on two different supplements. Um, you're going to do 10 days of those supplements. Okay. Then you're going to take a 10 day break and then you're going to do the 10 days again of those same supplements. Okay. And what about the diet? So good question. So we're going to keep you on basically the same type of lifestyle that you've been living in the okay. last 10 days of that cleanse where you're okay. doing, you know, fruits and vegetables, twice as many veggies as fruit and then having that lean meat like the chicken and the fish. Okay. We just want to kind of keep on that that same type of diet. I don't know about you, but I don't really want a lot of, you know, parasites or worms in my no, body. No, 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 no. So, and so that's why I want to take you to this next level. Okay. I'm going through and, and cleansing, making sure that we've got And that also involves the uh, colonic hydration, right? That's what we call hydrotherapy. <laughs> yeah, we use the colonic hydrotherapy to make sure that we're flushing all okay. those out. That's, the, of course, one of the things that everybody asks me about uh, are the colonics, and it really wasn't as bad as I thought. Everyone's terrified when, when we no. tell them we want to do that or when I mention that that would be a, a good option for them to do for their digestive yeah. issues. and. The tube is very, very small, it's about the size of a pencil. Right. It gets inserted into the patient for about about an inch, so it's, right. not, like it's, it's not very invasive. Right. Um, and we also, you know, it's not like it's a fire hose. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's you know, the water is just generally released into the into the colon, and so a lot of times it's more of a relaxing effect for most patients. Yeah, I thought it was. I thought it was really relaxing. Good. Yeah. Well, like I said, I think the results that you experience is basically what most people experience. Yeah. The tiredness. The, the, the cravings, you know, we get all that out of their system. And like you say, it's like a, a new you, you know, energized and feeling better, happier. It's and amazing so, that those sort of things like fatigue and, and depression are like just sitting inside you because of the, the food that you eat. It's yeah. kind of crazy. You got to think if you're putting crap in that you're going <clears> to <throat> have crap. Where yeah. if we're putting good, you know, very rich nutrient food into our body, your yeah. body's going to function the way it's supposed to. So I think we're always looking for answers outside of ourselves rather than sort of taking some responsibility for how we feel. It's easier to point the finger somewhere else. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I would agree. When we come back, we'll be bringing Dr. Gordon and Matthew into the studio to see the results of his colon hydrotherapy and of course, the 21 day cleanse. Welcome back. Well, as you can see, we've been joined by Dr. Gordon and Matthew. Hey guys. How's it going? So I'm pretty good. Maddie, you're looking a bit skinny mini. Oh yeah, I How feel you great. Feeling? Amazing. Really? Amazing. Yeah. Do you? I do, I actually I feel really great. Very quickly, mm -hmm. how's it changed your life? Oh, in a lot of ways. I sleep better, I'm happier, I'm lighter on my feet, uh, my clothes fit. I mean, in so many ways. Yeah. I, yeah. I'm I'm happy about that. Yeah. Dr. Gordon, is that something you hear a lot about when they've done the parasite cleanse, they've done the 21 day cleanse? He's done it all. Everyone, everyone that does <laughs> the cleanse, if you know, if they follow the cleanse like they're supposed to, yeah. um, they lose weight, they lose inches. Um, everyone says they, they drop down a size or two. Uh, it's, it's what happens when you get all of that crap, all that toxins yeah. out of your system. Well, and crap being the obvious word because your body <laughs> is full of it. Yeah. Truly. Yeah. You're supposed yeah. to have a bowel movement after every meal, a minimum of once a day. Yep. If you're not, then all that stuff is sitting in your colon, and over time it actually starts to seep back into your body. And, and you feel sick. Horrible. Your skin's great. Matt, were you um, having a bowel movement every day? I, I was, yeah. <laughs> when we first came into the, into the show, we were talking about how bad his habits were and what he was eating. He wasn't that bad, I didn't think. Yeah, and that's, and that's a lot of people think, oh, I don't eat that bad. Yeah. You know, I just had a couple Diet Cokes a day or some a couple French fries or hamburgers here and there. Mm. People can even be having a bowel movement every single day and still have a lot of stuff building up in their system, still have a lot of toxins. When you say toxic, you mean physical toxins, which can also affect you mentally as well. Yeah. You yeah. just feel like crap. All right. <laughs> yeah. Well, I guess so. <laughs> um, Maddie. 
I yeah. wanted to say, now, I haven't asked you up until right now, because right. we've been watching the progress. Right. What have you lost? Well, on the 21-day cleanse, I lost 18 pounds. What? Yeah. But hold on. That was eating and exercising. You were doing the program. How many colon hydrotherapies were you having a week? Four. Four? Is that the average? Typically, or did we push him? <laughs> That's typically what we'll do is just because uh, the way our system works is we want to do them back to back, do them in a series. Yeah. So we usually do about four a week just mm. so we can get up into the colon and try and clean everything out. It wasn't just about the colon hydrotherapy. It was the diet that you were doing at home mm -hmm. plus supplements. Talk me through the supplements. What was the first one that he had to use? So the first one he was on is called SP Complete. And it's yeah. a shake that he would take two to three times a day. has all your vitamins, minerals, nutrients that you need which for you know for him in this case he wasn't getting a lot of that from his daily diet and that's well, he was eating for, crap yeah and that's how it's for most people they're not getting all that nutrients yeah so this is kind of the first one of the first ones we, we include in to make sure that we're getting all that nutrients in the body okay maddie yes did you like having the shake every day yeah it was really easy i mean i think that that was the best part for me is i just got up and i made a shake through a banana and some fruit usually some berries and yeah and a little bit of water and just water, so you that mix was, it that with was the water. That was my breakfast. One of the things we add to the to the shake is uh -huh. one of the other products is it's it's a it's a whole food fiber. Okay. Because there are a lot of people that are not eliminating, right. you know, daily like they're supposed to. So the fiber helps get in there and clean everything out. So that was kind of the other thing that we mixed that in was with the, the shake. Thing. So yeah. it's a two step shake. You've two got two shake. additives to it with the water. And with a lot of pa people too, what they'll do is they'll add, you know, fruits, berries, mm. vegetables into the shake just to kind of help with flavor. Right. Usually with the cleanse, we do twice as many veggies as the ah. sugar. The other things that he was using, what's the next one? So the next up? one he was going to be on for the first week, for his first seven days, mm. he was on a product called SP Cleanse. Yeah. And that one is, it's like a bulldozer. It just goes through and just detoxifies, cleans everything out. Uh, so and, which it sounds spending, bad. Well, I was going to say, you're spending a lot of time in the bathroom. Really, you're not. It's not, it's not <laughs> something where you, where you have to be right by a, a toilet or anything. Right. You, you can still function throughout your day. Okay. And so, but that one is kind of the one that goes through and just really detoxifies the body. So I want to ask you, Matthew, did you feel that you needed to be near a bathroom at all? No, never. And one of my biggest fears was working. I didn't want to have low energy levels yeah. while I was working. I was scared that that, that would that happen would and that problem. never that never happened. I, I managed to work better. I'm really glad to hear that you can actually still have that yeah, energy I can't to afford, keep going. I can't afford to be that way yeah, at 3 o'clock. Not at all. That's your peak time, darling. Yeah. Isn't it? it sure You're is. just getting going. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, Dr. Gordon, what's the other product we're looking at now? So then the last product, so after that first seven days, we move him to another product. And so instead of being on the SP Cleanse, he moves over to what's called the SP Green Food, uh -huh. which is basically a lot of the greens and stuff that we're not getting in our daily diets. So, I'm just about to look at the before pictures, Matthew, and I've forgotten <laughs> because I was there, I was there before we took these pictures, okay, when yeah. I first introduced you to Dr. Gordon. So let's just take a little look at you where you are now. How were you feeling there? I look frumpy and slobby. I, do you think I felt good? Did no. you? Okay. I didn't know that I didn't feel good, but no, I didn't. He's just kind of a classic, you know, everyday person that we see all the time that is just, they're not eating right, or sometimes they don't know how to eat, or sometimes they think, well, I'm not eating that bad. Yeah. But the problem is, is that, you know, years of doing that, it just catches up with you, and that's when we start to see the, the gut start to get distended, and we start seeing where they're losing sleep, they're tired all the time, all of those, mm. those symptoms that Matthew yeah. was having. Interesting that you did the 21-day cleanse. Mm -hmm. They came and you phoned me and you were like, I feel great, this is amazing. So I called Dr. Gordon and I said, what's he up to now? Yeah. And you just you decided to put him on a parasite cleanse. Well, yeah, the reason why is because as we were doing the colon hydrotherapy, yeah. you know, every time we always analyze everything that comes out with the patient is because there's a lot of feedback that we can get of what's going on with the system. Okay. And so, um, and, that, and unfortunately, one of the things we saw was there was some worms, some parasites that were in the, the You the got a bit of worm. <laughs> yeah. oh, I'm sorry about that. Yeah, it's a, little, <laughs> it's, a little, it's a little freaky. You know, before doing the 21-day cleanse, I kind of expected it. Did you? Yeah. Because I kind of thought that everybody has parasites. and okay. they do. So I kind of expected to see them, and I was happy to really just go the distance uh, with cleaning out my system. Uh, the parasite cleanse, how long was he on that for? You're on two supplements, 10 days, you take them, and then you take a 10-day break, okay. and then you do it 10 days again. All right. Usually that first 10 days goes through and kills all the, you know, a lot of the, of the adults. Yeah. A lot of the babies will kind of go into hiding and so, or if there's any eggs that, that are hatching, that's where that 10-day break, they'll start to come back out. 
and that second 10 day we go through and kill them again. It's like I'm sitting here listening to you and absorbing it all as I'm sure everyone will be at home and I'm thinking does that make me feel dirty by having parasites? It's such a scary word. I find that like probably 90% of people have them. Right. Usually if you, if you do a lot of fish or especially you know raw fish, okay. Um, if you've been outside the country, like you know, third world countries, mm. sometimes even eating, eating a lot of uh, red meats, depending on where you're getting it from. Just if you're exposed to some of those types of things, typically you're going to have. Gonna well, have see, parasites. I didn't think sushi was that bad. No, but, I'm thinking it was pretty good. Everyone loves sushi. Before the cleanse, when I said <laughs> I ate sushi at least once a week, uh, Dr. Gordon looked at me like, "Oh dear." Okay. <laughs> like, not, you were like, not good. "No, you thought you were being real I good." Thought, yeah, sushi. It's <laughs> great. Okay. It's you've done it. Okay. Yes. You feel amazing. Matt, do you think you can stick to it? You've been off it two weeks now. Yeah, I think I can stick to it. I think, you know, getting into the veggie habit is the, hel is the healthiest thing that mm. I would recommend. Learning how to fix veggies, um, how to eat them, and enjoying them. That's, that's been one of the biggest things for me. So mm. I, I can't imagine giving up my veggies. Really? At all now? No. Is it a success? Oh, Are you saying what we say it. in Australia, you're tickled pink? I <laughs> 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 so you're happy with everything? I am happy with everything. Yeah, he, he's done really, really well, and, and um, this is basically what we experience with every patient that does okay. it. Thank you, you know I was not expecting you to succeed, oh which yeah, is yeah, really yeah, bad, I yeah, know. We're friends, so you're on, you've been on my case. And I was like, you better be thin lot. by the time you get back <laughs> into my studio. Dr. Yeah. Gordon, thanks for putting him through his paces. Oh, that's what I do. I, I think it's great. I, you know, you look good, buddy. You Thank really you. do. Thank I hope you, you at home learned a lot about Kylan Hydrotherapy and how to cleanse your body. For more information about Dr. Gordon and my show, head over to theyoungeryou.tv and I'll see you next week. Next week on The Younger You, we'll meet Courtney, a 29-year-old mother of three in need of a makeover. With the help of the Marinello School of Beauty, she was made over from top to toe. Come back next week to see her final reveal.